Hey guys, what is up? Arav here. Welcome back to the Scientific Pros. Today we have a presentation on quantum computers. Enjoy. So, what are quantum computers? Or in simpler words, a quantum computer is a type of computer that uses quantum mechanics so it can perform certain kinds of computation more efficiently than a regular computer can. So I will explain why it is more efficient later in the video. So, we first need to know quantum mechanics. Quantum mechanics explains how the universe works at a scale smaller than atoms. It is also called quantum physics or quantum theory. Mechanics is the part of physics that explains how things do. That's pretty obvious. So, as you already might know, with the com computers that y'all are using right now, the operating system or in the motherboard consists of zeros and ones. In quantum mechanics, it's different. In quantum mechanics, we use qubits. A qubit is a quantum is a quantum bit that is the basic unit of information in a quantum computer. It has something, a particle or an electron, for example, that adopts two possible states. And while it is in superposition, the quantum computer and especially built al algorithms harness the power of these both states. So while normal computers harness the power only zero or one. The com quantum computers can do both. So, uh, the great question. How do they work? How do computers actually work? Quantum computers perform calculations based on the probability of an object state before it is measured. So, it predicts what you're going to do. So, uh, that can make the computer faster. Instead of just ones or zeros, which means they have the potential of process exponentially more data compared to classical computers. Like I explained in the previous, uh, like I explained in the previous slide. So now let's move on to who invented, who are these geniuses who invented quantum computers. So, who invented them? First of all, Niels Bohr. Niels Henrik David Bohr was a Danish physicist who made a foundational contribution to understanding atomic structures and of course the quantum theory. Next, Max Planck. Max Carl Ernest Ludwig Planck, for MEM RS, was a German theoretical physicist whose discovery of energy quanta won him the Nobel Prize in Physics in, 19, uh, in 1918. So, energy quanta is basically another word in, in German for quantum, that is quantum computers. So, um, yeah, we're gonna end it off there. Thank you for watching.